I'm Jason Roselle. You're watching Get Inspired with Jason. Today's a new dating episode and we're gonna talk about how to create and really thrive your relationship to the next level. Now in previous episodes, and like I always remind you, how do we even know if we are in the best relationship ever? It's one word, peace. Yes, if you have peace within yourself and your partner and that person really makes you just, ah, feel amazing, feel secure and safe, you know you're in a rocking, amazing relationship, right? Not a relationship where you're walking on eggshells, you're feeling anxious saying, oh my God, did I say the right thing? Did I do the right thing? That is a no-brainer, toxic relationship that you just do not wanna be in. Now that's a whole nother topic and if you have questions on that, comment below. Now let's talk about already what you have found. You found the man of your dreams, the woman of your dreams. How do we keep that relationship going? Number one, do not be complacent. Anything you did in the beginning, such as whether it was massages, you were cooking for them, opening up doors, the list goes on. Don't just settle. Really, and I mean really, take it up a notch, right? You did that then, not only do you wanna keep that up, but you wanna make sure you're doing more. Yes, writing a cute text message or an email is great. Why not take the time and actually handwrite a little sticky note? Maybe a card to make them know how awesome they feel. Set up a vacation unexpectedly, something that you know is going to make them happy, you happy, and vice versa. Number two, be kind. Yes, be kind. Look, I get it. In a lot of relationships, things get sticky. You know, familiarity breeds contempt. You get to know each other's thoughts, actions, and you're like, oh my gosh, she's gonna leave the shoes there. Why did he leave the coffee mug there? You can sit there, complain, bicker, the list goes on, but don't be kind. Take a moment, breathe, and ask yourself, wait a minute, you know, does she or he deserve me to yell, to complain and bicker about that? Maybe if we're kinder to one another, we can actually get more than what we expected. So make sure before you just chomp on your partner and chew their head off, that you just take a moment, realize this is the man, the woman that I love, that I care for, my longevity partner of life, partner of life, why would I do that? And number three, this is the kicker. This is the one I want you to go full throttle with. Most importantly, take the time for your partner. Yes, schedule out, just like you have to go to school, work, maybe you have kids, you have to take them to their activities, their school games, whatever it be, just like you go to the gym, allocate time, prioritize time for your partner. Because a lot of times, no matter how much we love our partner, we cannot take them for granted. And I mean that because, look, life gets busy, we get busy, but this is the person that you chose to spend the rest of your life with. And look, they're busy, you're busy. But when you really take the time to prioritize, okay, I'm gonna spend X day, X day, X night with them, right? It shows that you care. So get together with your partner right now and really set up a schedule that's gonna work for both of you. So not only do you keep it alive, but you keep it thriving, right? It's like a body, right? You don't just work out once or twice, take off your shirt and say, wow, I got an amazing body. No, you gotta continue working at it. Same thing with your brain. You can't just read one book and never read it again and expect that you took it all in. Read it a couple times a year sometimes even three times a year. Why? Because you're gonna adapt, you're gonna learn and just really thrive on that. And that's the same thing with your relationship, right? The more consistent and persistent you are, the better it's gonna get. And when you're sitting back just saying, wow, why am I so effing happy? Not only is it because you have peace within yourself and in this awesome relationship, because you're constantly working and thriving to make it better which is gonna make your union with your partner the best union ever. If you have any questions or comments, shoot me below a comment. If you wanna work with me, maybe you're stuck, you're at a plateau, you're, you just wanna get unstuck and wanna really take your relationship to the best level, or maybe you're single and you wanna get into a relationship, go ahead and visit my website, jasonrosell.com. You can check out my seminars, as well as one-on-one -on -one phone, Skype, and in-person consultations, yes, I do work globally, it doesn't matter where you live, we will make it happen. Share this with friends and family that you think it can help. And most importantly, I hope this inspired you. Did it? Get inspired with Jason. I'll see you on the next one.
Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you're a new viewer, and don't forget to click on the bell so you can get notifications every time a new show releases. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like, and feel free to leave your comments. I'm Jason Roselle, and you're watching Get Inspired with Jason.